Welcome to Ranking Mastery. We are excited that you joined us. This is going to be a great adventure and a new way to get discovered so on the web. I am too. This, this is, is awesome. so much work and finally it's here. <laughs> All right. So tell us what we're going to do here, Dave. The goal is to make your website effective to get out there for all your keywords, to make sure that you're found on the internet. And the coolest thing is this is a long-term investment because once you set this up, you've got all these pages matriculating around the internet. Google's gonna find them. You're gonna keep getting better rankings, more traffic, which is more money for you. Yeah. That's the goal. So patience is definitely needed because you know we make these pages, but Google has to index them one by one or whatever. I don't know how they do it all, but uh, they're going to just keep on going out there. And as you build them and as you add your assets, as we're going to show you in this video, you're going to get better and better rankings and you're going to love the results. Absolutely. So here's the thing. My, me personally, I'm not very good at software, so it takes me forever to figure it out. And if it's complicated, I get frustrated. So what we did is we challenged Dennis, the creator of the software, to make it simple for someone like me. Okay, and so he created this really cool way to make it easy for you. I mean, you only have to invest a couple hours at the most, and you can have your entire software setup, account, websites, all over the place. And it's using a wizard that takes you step by step to set up your account, set up your site, set up your keywords, put your images in, all the things that you need to be successful. So how did you do it? Well, basically, bottom line is, is you know, I went to Dave, I went to different friends, did all kinds of Zooms, and just continue to show them this kind of clunky process at first. But they kept on saying, hey, I, I don't understand this. I don't understand this. So we kind of worked one by one. And the bottom line is, is we're going to just give you only what you need to work on first. And it's going to be a step-by-step -step process. And we're going to strongly encourage you to get each one of those things done one by one because we put them in a specific order because of how we need to get you ranked. So as you do these steps, literally almost instantly, Google is going to start looking for these pages we build. And we'll go through that in the wizard. But right now, Dave, why don't we give them a little overview of the dashboard? I, I agree. You made a great decision. Let's show them the dashboard. Show them how easy it is to get started. And uh, don't stop now. you got to get through this. Just get through this little process. And it's so simple. And once you do, then all you have to do is come back occasionally and make some updates, add new podcasts, new videos and start to build your entire network. So here we go, we're going in to check out the dashboard and the wizard. All right, so here's the basic dashboard in wizard mode, okay? Obviously your screen looks a little different, you're looking at this video and then right below it's gonna be saying click to get started and it's gonna jump you right into wizard mode. But once you're kinda of done, uh, kinda of doing what you wanna do, there's gonna be a dashboard that you look at and this is the dashboard. So we're gonna show you in different modes. There's three different modes. There's one is wizard mode, um, there's editing mode and then there's marketing mode. We're going to only show you the wizard mode here today and maybe the editing version. But right now we want to keep you focused on the wizard and getting through that because that's really, really, really important. That's how you set up a company. So yes. you're going to set this up. Yeah, it's a business plan, right? So starting from the top, if you see in the top hand corner, we got the word dashboard. Okay. Anytime you want to get back to the dashboard, guess what? You just click dashboard and that'll get you right back there. Next to what you see an eyeball. That's basically where you'll always go to look at your page. What does it look like? What does it look like? Click on that eye and you're gonna see your page. You can go through it and check it out. Okay, very, very simple. That's your preview of your website. Next is where we show the wizard mode button. We put it right at the top there if you wanna go toggling back and forth. Because once you kind of figure this out, you're not gonna to wanna to see all this wizard stuff. You're not gonna to wanna to see text in wizard. You're just gonna to wanna to get right in there and edit your stuff. You just click on that. It'll turn off the wizard. It'll change the view of the screen. Really nice. And then next to that is our best feature yet. It's called the go to. And so basically the go to replaces all of the other choices. So if, once you get used to the software and you're really good at it and you know your way around, you don't have to go through the stuff on the page. You just go to go to page and pick whatever you want to work on. So it makes it super, super simple. simple. Exactly. So use the go to page. Once you kind of get through the wizard, you understand the software. Um, Moving over to next is basically your simple, your basically your account information, all your stuff that you do for your basic account. So you have two accounts. You have your account, that master account, and then you have your account for each one of your individual web pages that you create. So you can create more than one page with more than one sets of keywords, and we'll show you that in Wizard later on. After that, you can then go to the progress bar. Clearly, we're gonna show you how far along you're going. 
And then at the end is the logout. So that's basic th stuff you need is on the navigation. At the top. So once you've learned that, which is so simple, then you can go to the wizard, set it up. If you don't want the wizard, you turn it off. And then you can get to your information either with one of these columns or you can go to go to page and find your way around the entire uh, piece of software. Yeah. And also we're always going to give you the latest and greatest and help videos on the side there on the far right. So you can always have access to the videos. You want to kind of go refresh your mind or see something new. Um, it'll all be there. And basically you'll see we also have trainings and, and events that will be going on. Those will be posted right on your dashboard. And what's new, of course, the new features, you'll be able to click on that and you'll see what's been added or what's coming up soon. And then again, down below, if you're not in wizard mode, you're gonna see your leads are gonna show up on there. What leads have come in, they're gonna show up there as well. So this is really a basic overview of how to use the dashboard. But if you're not, if you're confused, you can always go to the word go to at the top and you can get to any of the pages that we're gonna be talking about in the wizard. Anything so else, Dave? Just keep it simple, like click the button below to get started, go through the wizard, and once that's done, you're gonna see this entire thing, the magic's gonna happen. Right. And then you're gonna see this whole process completed. And then you can go in and play around and make some changes and edits and have fun with the system. Yeah, so one thing I wanna point out about this different between like WordPress or Wix, or maybe like a ClickFunnels marketing software, those are both really great platforms. But with the Wix kind of WordPress thing, you basically, you know, you kind of get this really, really pretty website page that's more of a brochure, and it's really kind of tactically difficult to make it more of a marketing funnel or maybe even an SEO page because there's a lot of clunkiness to that. And also in funnels on the ClickFunnels end or lead gen type marketing funnels, over there that's really great too. You can make a very specific page, but it can kind of end up being a website as well if you don't really understand the fact that you can make this incredible you know, $20,000 funnel, but if you're not funneling leads to that, it can't convert. So if you have to be an expert at Facebook ads, you have to be an expert at YouTube ads, or even doing email blasts in order to feed that funnel. Well, the ranking mastery is kind of like right in the middle. It, it uses SEO to get the attention you need, and it also gives you that chance to make a pretty page, but also forces you to kind of focus on what you need to do. Combine your assets, Make sure that they're relative to the content and make SEO pages. And the best part is it's so simple. All the magic happens behind the scenes. You don't have to learn how to build websites and learn all these different modes. You literally set it up once, make whatever changes, edits that you want along the way, but you don't have to learn it all. You have to just set it up and then everything happens naturally. It happens normally and it's very exciting. So we're excited to have you here. We're here for you, a great service team. If you have any questions, let us know. Get this thing started today and it starts to go to work for you today.